Arpita. I have another slow fashion video for you. Today I want to talk about how to build a sustainable slow fashion closet when you are on a budget or when you don't want to spend a lot of money. If you are new here, welcome. Every week I talk about a sustainable and slow fashion focusing on how you can have a stylish wardrobe with a minimalistic approach. Use and love what you already have and make smart shopping choices so that you can create a closet full of clothing that you actually love and wear. If that sounds like what you want to watch, hit the subscribe button below and activate the bell icon next to it. Let's get into the video now. Use what you have. I talk about it all the time. You can try mixing and matching different items in your wardrobe to create new outfits. I have many videos showing how to wear one garment in different ways. I kept the link in the description box for you. If you are feeling creative, you could even try Customizing your clothes by adding uh, patches, embroideries or other embellishments. There are many ways to get creative and make the most of the clothes you already have. Swap your clothes. Swap parties and swapping uh, events are becoming very popular these days. When you swap clothes uh, with someone else, you can get new items for your wardrobe without having to pay for them. This can be a great way to refresh your wardrobe without breaking the bank. It is a more sustainable way of getting new clothes. The clothing industry is a major contributor to pollution and waste and the production of new clothing can be resource intensive. By swapping uh, clothes with others, you can reduce the demand for new clothing and help to reduce the environmental impact of the fashion industry. Swapping clothes can also be a fun and social activity. Many people enjoy getting together with friends or family members to swap clothes and try on each other's styles. This can be a great way to bond with others and explore new fashion options. Finally, swapping clothes can also help to prevent clothing from going to waste. When you swap clothes with uh, someone else, you are giving an item that you no longer want a new home. This can help uh, to extend the life of uh, clothing and prevent it from ending up in the landfill. Rent the clothes. One of the main benefits of renting clothes is uh, that it can save you money. When you rent clothing, you only pay for wearing the item for a short period instead of paying the full price to own it. This can be especially useful for special occasions or events where you may only need an outfit for a single day or night. Another benefit of uh, renting clothes is that it can be more environmentally friendly than buying new clothes. Finally, renting clothes can also give you access to a wider range of clothing options. When you rent clothing, you can try out different styles and designers uh, without committing to buying them. This can be a great way to experiment with your style and find new fashion favorites. Shopping with a list. Before we get into where to shop, let me talk about the importance of making a list for any kind of shopping. If you follow my videos or Instagram, you know that I shop with a list. It can help you stay organized and focused on um, what you need to buy. Without a shopping list, you may end up uh, forgetting items that you need or buying things that you don't need. A shopping list can also help you stay within your budget by reminding you of the items you need to buy and the amount you plan to spend on each item. A shopping list can save you time by allowing you to quickly and easily find the items you need in the store without having to search through racks of clothing. Overall, a shopping list can help you make the most of your clothing shopping experience by keeping you organized, focused and on budget. Now let's see different ways you can shop for your clothing. 
shop second hand shopping second hand will extend the life of a garment and reduce its carbon foot footprint it can be more affordable than buying new clothes second hand clothing can also be unique and offer a wider variety of styles and sizes than what is typically available in stores you can find different second hand stores on instagram nowadays you need to hunt for a little bit to find what exactly you are looking for additionally shopping for second hand clothing can be a more sustainable option as it reduces the demand for new clothing slow and intentional if you do have to shop or prefer the shopping experience of chain stores there are ways that you can shop slowly intentionally and more sustainably materials when you are shopping in those stores look for items uh, made of natural fibers like organic cotton linen stencil silk and wool also make sure to look for 100% of the material on the label blended fabrics cannot be recycled if you have to shop at these stores do your research if they have an organic collection or a con consciously made collection in these stores when you choose recycled material or organic material at least you are sending a message that uh, those are what consumers are looking for and they need to change their supply chain designs when you are shopping in these uh, big stores look for classic designs and styles the pieces have very clean details no trendy embellishments and the colors are neutral or the colors that you love choose the clothes that you know you will wear for a very very long time even when it is out of trend because it suits you and you love them quality look very carefully for the signs of good quality clothing by seeing the insides of the garment the details like the neatly finished stitches and the lined garments are a sign of uh, durability embroidered labels instead of printed labels are a sign of good quality just look for uh, those signs of uh, solid construction and you will be able to keep that item for a very long time that is all i have for you today hope you find this video useful if you did give a thumbs up there is an option of saying thanks to me by clicking the thanks button under this video your support will help me create more informative videos just like this one share the video to raise awareness thank you so much for watching i will be back with another video next week bye